We are not used to see this kind of huge ash eruptions of the Stromboli, but this is what happened. This is what we have in front of us. Uh, we see two craters, one of them active, and erupting an ash cloud. This is not a Strombolian style, this is Plinian style mostly. We have ash rising, we don't see any flames or anything, which is the sign of the Stromboli. A flame or fountain of lava several hundred meters. This is not what we see. This is the island of the Stromboli, not very big. It's only 300 something. And uh, even there are two villages on both sides of it, the white bits on the uh, upper left and uh, upper right and the uh, lower left. This is what we are used to see. A little ash flow, then uh, lava flowing down toward the sea very quick. These are the areas that they never get vegetation because they're all the time are being resurfaced. They remain gray. They're not covered with vegetation. And this is what we see normally, even from when you go to the, you know, with the thermal imaging camera, the, you, the best you can see is that in the night you can photograph it like that. Pieces of lava, you know, thrown into the air. Sometimes you see something like this. What we saw today is rare, is unique in that sense. And the village of Stromboli around it is not used to it. It can make it a little bit dangerous sometimes when you feel, when you think about it.